Okay, on this video, I want to show you how to uh, set a password on your Excel file. Here we are in Excel, of course. I'm going to pick on Office and then just pick one of these documents. Well, let's say this is a spreadsheet that you don't want everybody to get into. Uh, some people maybe shouldn't be in there at all, or some people you just want to go in there as read only. Okay, so here's how we can do that. Uh, you're going to do a save as. I'm going to pick on Office and then save as. You're going to come over here and uh, just click on the word save as. And then you see, you see where it says tools over here. You're going to click on that pull down and then you're going to say general options. Now there's two passwords. One is a password to open and one is a password to modify. You, you know, you would put in something different for each one of those. And make it a password that people can easily figure out. And then it's going to ask you to verify those. So I'm going to put in uh, my first password and then put in the second password. And by the way, these are case sensitive. So make sure you type in the exact same thing. Uh, now I'm going to pick on save here. And now it's asking you to overwrite the file, but it's just really overwriting it with itself. So you don't have to worry about that. That's okay. All right, now let's close out of this document and let's see what's going to happen now. Now I'm going to try to reopen up the same document. So I'll pick on office and then the same document. Notice how it's asking me for the first password. It, I'm going to type in an incorrect password. If they don't know the first password, they're not going to get in at all. Okay, so that's the first level of protection here. Now uh, let's try that again. This time I'm going to type in the first password. And now, um, now it's asking for the second password. If they don't know the second password, they can get in as read only. So I'll pick on read only here. And now they're into the spreadsheet. Uh, they could even make changes to the spreadsheet. As you can see, they just can't save it. It's, now it says it's read only. Uh, now they can save a copy to a different file, but they can't save the original file. So I'm gonna click on okay. Uh, look at my mouse up here. I'm, not, I'm actually not going to save this uh, to a different copy, but they could if they wanted to. Notice how it says read only up here. So they can make their changes. Everything will work in the spreadsheet. They just can't save it. All right. Now, if you ever want to change your passwords or delete them, you're going to close out of the workbook. And you're going to reopen up the workbook and this time go in with both passwords. You need the first one and the second one and they are case sensitive. So now what you do is you just do another save as. Office, save as, pick on tools again, pick on general options again, and now at this point, you can either delete the passwords that are there or you can uh, change them to something different. So in order to do that, you have to, be, you have to log on with both passwords. Now I'm gonna save the file. Let's see what happens when I close it this time. And then I'm going to try to reopen it. And you can see it didn't ask for the passwords. I, I, delete, I deleted those. So that's how you can password protect uh, your Excel spreadsheets.